Hello and welcome to Syncfix. In this video, I'm going to show you how to install and configure Nginx Proxy Manager. Nginx Proxy Manager is a free and open source reverse proxy manager that will make it easy to manage your web application. It is a great tool for anyone who wants to host multiple web applications on a single server. Stay tuned till end of this video to see how we can install Nginx Manager and how we can configure it on Docker. In previous video, I have shown you how we can install Docker. And then on top of Docker, we have installed Portainer. So if you see here at containers, so in container, Portainer is running right now. And if you see the images right now, Portainer image is available to you. So if you see here, sudo docker ps. So right now, only one container is running. I'll go here, nginx proxy manager, get started. And you can see here, quick setup. In quick setup, of course, there are multiple options. Uh, you can also use the command line tool, but we'll not be using command line tool. I'll be simply copying this and we'll go here, click on stack. So we'll be creating a new stack here, add stack. And it will be called engine x proxy manager. And I'll be using dash here because spaces are not allowed. And simply paste this node here. And it will automatically get the image and then it will restart unless uh, it is uh, stopped. And these are three ports, the port 80 and port 443, port 81 is for the admin panel. And right now volume is fine, uh, data and data, and I'll not be encrypting the volume. I'll just uh, remove the encryption here and simply deploy the stack. So it will be automatically deployed. It will create the image and it will create the container. So we'll wait for this process to complete. And we'll also see the documentation here. This is the bare minimum configuration required. So if you want to see the detailed documentation, you can click here. So full setup is available here in case you want to make any changes to it. In case you want to connect it with external database, that can also be done. If you want to install on Raspberry Pi, that can also be done. And here is the default user ID and password for Nginx proxy manager. So default user ID is this and password is this. And then of course you can make the changes. So this was all the setup instructions. So we'll see your stack is already available here. If I go to containers, so you can see here Nginx proxy manager is running, which is running on port 80. So if I click here on port 80, port 443, port 81. So all of these are of course working, but on the IP address, which is here. So I'll be just bring this IP address here and i'll paste it now this is port 80 which you can see here that proxy manager is working and if i go here to 443 or https which is running right now here if i go to port 81 this is where we'll do the configuration so we'll enter the user id which is available here example.com admin at example.com here we go with the login and password is change me sign in and save it and current password was change me see host zero redirection host zero streams and four zero four ports so i can create a new proxy host here depending upon which type of uh, uh, application you are running, its domain will be as this will be my proxy manager. So I'll be configuring this and I add a new uh, DNS record here, which will be a container for syncrix.com and its IP address is 192.168. Dot hundred dot one seventy seven. So apply. 
So it is pinging from uh, this particular IP address, which means that uh, if on my proxy server, uh, URL should take me automatically to this. I'll just open this client sent HTTP request to an HTTPS server. So it means that portainer is on HTTPS. So I need to change this Nginx proxy from this particular HTTP to HTTPS. Save. So I'll click this again. Now you can see here, instead of IP address, portainer is running on HTTPS. Similarly, I can also configure the Nginx also, so I need to make sure that Nginx is running on uh, uh, same IP address. So I'll create another DNS record for Nginx. You can see here two DNS records are configured here, and both of them will be through the proxy server going to different DNS. So one IP address, two DNS. So if I go here to Nginx proxy server also again here add a new proxy nginx dot syncfix dot com one nine two dot one six eight dot check dot one double seven and port is and publicly accessible here and if I open this here yes you can see here nginx is running on this particular DNS record here nginx is here and portainer is here on this particular DNS so this is the beauty of uh, Nginx proxy server. So in this video, we have seen how we can install and configure uh, Nginx proxy server. So this was one of the containers that we have installed inside our Docker installation. We used Portainer to install. I have created this for home lag, but you can use this for enterprise development and cloud and so on. If you found this content helpful, be sure to check our playlist for more informative videos just like this. Our playlist is filled with valuable tutorials, tips and best practices that will help you to master the world of Docker and containers. Whether you are a beginner looking to get started or an experienced user wanting to expand your knowledge, we have got you covered. Subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. See you in next video. Take care and goodbye.